My name is Gianluca Frasso, I'm 31 years old. I'm a postdoc for uh, University of Liege, where uh, I work as a statistician. The nice thing of being a statistician is that uh, it's not hard for us to collaborate with other researchers coming from different research fields. I'm working on the definition of statistical or inferential techniques for the estimation of models described by differential equations. Uh, those equations uh, are driven by certain parameters. Our uh, research aims to establish new methodologies for the estimation of these unknown parameters. The uh, project was about the modeling of the Ebola outbreak in Sierra Leone. Consider that we have a population with uh, sites N, that this population we can distinguish at least three uh, categories of subjects. Some of them are at risk, some of them are infectious, and the other part of the population is uh, what we call removed, where the removed subject can be dead or recovered. What we observe over time is the number of new infectious subjects. Now we want to know how many people from the infectious compartment move to the removed compartment at each time t. This uh, parameter is unknown. So an infectious people takes, uh, let's say, gamma over one days to move from the infectious compartment to the removed. This mechanism can be summarized in a set of differential equations. We want to estimate basically these two rates, the contact rate and the removing uh, rate. We do it uh, in a Bayesian framework that allows us to combine uh, prior information on those parameters. In particular, what we do is uh, actually considering that beta is time dependent and this is uh, unknown function of uh, time. And this function is uh, estimated uh, in a semi-parametric uh, way using p-spines. I started as a student in economics in Italy, where I took a master in finance. I discovered the master in Leiden. I always lived with my family, and that was my first experience uh, alone. The first two, three months were a bit uh, difficult, given my difficulties with the language. But I have to say, everybody was really helpful, uh, especially my professors. I noticed many differences between uh, cultural differences. Called professors by name, for example, to have communication that was not limited to a lecture or uh, to a lesson with them. I have to say, from a human point of view, the experience at the master for me was really great. The master program was fundamental for my career. It gave me the background, basically, for what I am now and for uh, my work. Starting from the, uh, the first uh, till the last day of the master, I never stopped to learn new things. I was free to choose my research topic, I was free to propose solutions, and that was really a good experience that helped me in the continuation of my career. I became really independent then uh, in my research.